What's going on? I'm JJ Watt. You're watching the JR Sports Brief. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's JR. You're checking out the Sport Brief. It is super early on New Year's Eve. I am tired. I need to go to sleep. But I'm pretty sure by now you all saw that Ronda Rousey got knocked out in 48 seconds by Amanda Nunes. And I'm pretty sure this is the end of her career. She got knocked out by Holly Holm a little more than a year ago. She disappeared, didn't talk to media, got real focused and ready for this fight. And she got knocked out. And we all know about her movies and the Hollywood opportunities. Will all of those things still be there now that she's lost two straight fights? And I'm pretty sure she doesn't want to fight anymore. She spoke about how depressed she was and how down in the dump she was after that Holly Holm defeat. But at the end of the day, this woman helped lay the groundwork for women's fighting in the mainstream, especially in the UFC. Dana White opened it up for her. 12 straight victories to start her career, six in the UFC until she lost these last two. What is Ronda Rousey's legacy? I mean, she laid the groundwork, and I think it's time for her to quit. And I mean, by all indications, I'm pretty sure that's what's going to go on. What did you think about the fight? And what's left for women fighting or women's fighting in the UFC? It's JR. I could barely speak. It's time for me to get knocked out myself. Shout outs to Ronda Rousey. That woman did it up. I hope all those opportunities are still there for her in Hollywood because I don't think there's any more opportunity in the UFC. Peace out, y'all. Later.